What's up everyone, Super Auto Gaming here, and today I bring you level 3 Beetle as quickly as possible. So, we get the perfect start here with 3 Beetles in the shop, that's already really really lucky, and, and even another one there at the end of the turn to freeze. Um, so yeah, sometimes you don't want to get a level 3 Beetle um, this quickly, or basically a level 3 anything this quickly. Uh, the only reason I level up on turn two so many times was hopefully to get a dromedary. That's the only reason. Because, of course, beetle and drom work very, very well together. So, we tried to do it there. We didn't get any, unfortunately. But now we can spend our, our whole turn here looking for more dromedaries. Which is exactly what we do. And we at least find one. We definitely don't want another beetle. And boom, two more right there. That's absolutely perfect. So this is looking like a great back to game. Also, we're going to fully greed out because why Why would you not? We get three dromedaries and a level three beetle um, for turn four. You couldn't ask for anything better. So this is a full greed kind of game. And uh, I'm not even going to freeze anything, I don't think, on tier two. We're looking for something good. We're looking for a tier three or a tier four unit. I think about freezing the peacock, but it's not the new peacock, therefore it's not good enough. By the way, this is on the live uh, version, so that's why we, we do that there. Um, but yeah, Dromedary Beetle, it's really, really good, probably too good. Um, some would say it's broken, and I would be inclined to agree with them. So we, we level up the Dromedary there. Hopefully getting a good four. Unfortunately, it's deer, but that's not that bad. And then we roll into a turtle, and that's definitely good enough to keep. So sometimes it's better to keep like two level two beetles or have one level two beetle and then the three separated so you can get a lot of triples on turn five. However, we didn't do that, so it looks a bit more like this. And this is full greed right here. This is the turn, since we're on last life, this is the turn that you're supposed to play your units. Um, so most of the time they would sell like their dromedary and snail there to either get deer or turtle in. However, I fully greed out and um, sometimes it doesn't work out, but this, this is the time that it does. And boy, am I glad because that would have been really unfortunate. However, we see a can too, which is absolutely perfect. So now we can get our deer in here and a 724 on turn seven that spawns a bus out of it is definitely good enough to at least tie us this next round. And we even get a buffalo, which is really, really good for us. Uh, so we're looking really strong here already. And there's no way, there's no way they could beat this. They get kind of close though. But thankfully our beetle's big enough too with garlic, so that should uh, hold us over. And we see a bison, so this is really, really nice. Now we can get rid of Drom, throw our salad on, and then buy both our bison and buffalo. And then next turn, we can get our turtle in, and that's a massive turtle, a 933. Yeah, that's, that's nothing to play around with. But um, I do, I do Drom Beetle quite a bit, as some of you have noticed. And it's just fun. It's just super fun. But I've been seeing more and more people recently because of a lot of the nerfs that are happening in Standard saying that Drom Beetle is going to be too strong. And I can see what they mean, especially in Versus. In Arena, not so much. You get a lot less turns to work with. Uh, however, in Versus, you get a lot more turns to Drom Beetle. And now, since Standard, they're nerfing, you know, Fish and Otter. Uh, they're going to have a lot harder time to keep up with these Drum Beetle strats. Because this was like a super lucky game, but let's be real, you do not need to get this lucky to have a Drum Beetle team work out. Uh, it works out most of the time. Get another can in here, do a couple buy cells, and then we can get our big turtle in here. And then of course we're on expansion, so we could even get a microbe eventually if we end up finding one. Um, but right now our team is very strong. For turn 10, this is kind of unbeatable. I don't know what team someone would have to have to beat this. And this is basically the full team. We, we don't need anything else. All we need to do is buy good food, uh, get a level 3 turtle if we can, and then, I mean, we're set. Like, look, he doesn't even make it to our deer. So, 
and uh, this is a little bit of a quick game too if you if you've noticed already it's because there, there's not a whole lot we have to think about uh, I guess it's another thing with drum beetle there's no thinking you just buy <laughs> you you freeze and then you buy as much food into the beetle as you can hold out until your last life and then just win so wait that guy was kind of weird he had a tiger behind his bison and not the rhino okay a little strange but um i could see it put a little steak action on our deer works out very well here yeah steak on um our front too would be very nice and um yeah just looking for food Tur a level two turtle we're basically unstoppable um, and I, we're not going to get Microbe in here, actually. Our team is way too big at this point. Like, the only thing we could realistically replace is Beetle, but that is getting our uh, Bison plus two plus two every turn. So I decided that that was just better, especially since we are now on eight wins. So, and the game hasn't gone on for too long, which means that we're probably, we'll probably be set. Yep, throw a little bit of pizza on there. Just get some good food. Yeah, even even Pear. Pear is good enough here to put on literally anyone. Probably Buffalo, though, since he is our main guy getting hit with um, Melon. And this is a little close, but not really. Like, they got some big guys, but even our front two, even just the front two, like, take out almost everything, and then the back can, can clean it up. I mean, like, look at this. This is... This is hard to beat, I'm telling you. So a level 3 beetle on turn 2 really goes hard. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you want to see more. And you know what? Have a fantastic day. Get those beetle players out of here, man.